Oh, hello there, internet. Welcome to round two. Let's go. Okay, we're back. Continue. Enter is Z. Okay, I have to remember how to do these controls. You, you run around this way. Oh, that's right. We were going to see... We were going into her house, but I really wanted to see what was down here first. Uh, because I remember there was a direction that you could go this way. Yeah, let's go some some exploring. We got some exploring. Oh. What is that? Is that a stabby stab? <gasps> you found the toy knife! Ooh. <laughs> Instead of our, our stick, we can whack things with the toy knife, I hope. Whoa, 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 whoa! Speedy McSpeedster there! Whoa! Okay. I understand. Do you smell that? Smell what? Surprise! Oh, that's right! There's a surprise for us here! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie! No! She's so sweet! I thought we might celebrate your arrival. Oh my goodness. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. I'm sorry? Snail pie? Snail pie. Here, I have another surprise for you. She's so sweet. Look at this cute little house she has. Can we look at it? Inside is an old calendar from the beginning of 20 teens wherever we are in the past. What's over here? Bookcase? It's a history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Aww. Far, far into the earth we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, which we named Home. <laughs> as great as our king is, he is pretty lousy at names. <laughs> Are there other books? It's a history- oh no, this is the same one. Okay. Aw, this is so sweet though, and it's funny that's a random page because it totally gives us great backstory and makes me really feel for our little- our little goat lady woman living here. The ends of the tools have been filed down to make them safer. Stop. The fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You could put your hand inside. Aww. No? Oh, seems like the right size for Toriel. I'm sure it is. Just the right size. Ooh, the kitchen is the most important place. For some reason, there is a brand brand named chocolate bar in the fridge. Interesting. There is some white fur stuck in the drain. <laughs> Inside the cupboard are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. What a nice smell. Too hot to eat, though. Is that our is that our pie? Our butterscotch cinnamon pie? The stovetop is very clean. Toriel must use fire magic instead. I'm sorry, how do you know that? That she uses fire magic? Can she use fire magic? Wait, that's super cool. Can I use fire magic? What's this? These books are worn. They must have been read many times. What's downstairs? This house is so cute. Oh, this looks like... <gasps> Hey, do not go down here. I have something to show you upstairs. <laughs> Grabs me by the hand. <laughs> well, that wasn't sketchy at all, Toriel. What does she want? Is she gonna eat me too? What if she's fattening me up to eat me? The flower was like, I got you. What if this is her big plan? This is it. Oh, I'm scared now. A room, a room of your own. I hope you like it. Oh, she just petted my head. Wait, that was so cute. Is something burning? Uh, make yourself at home. I don't trust. I don't trust. You've seen this type of plant before, but do not know its name. <laughs> Classic. What is that? What is that plant? Can you, can you tell me what that plant is? Can I go in her bedroom? This must be her bedroom. It's Toriel's diary. Read the circle passage? Yes. <laughs> you read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? We are such bad people. Oh no, because she was feeling bonely. <laughs> the rest of the page is filled with chunks of a similar caliber. <laughs> Of wet 
land flowering plants with brown oblong seed pods, known more commonly as water sausages. Great. You peek inside. Scandalous! It's Toriel's sock drawer! We're terrible. <laughs> ah, the cactus. Truly the most... I don't know what that word is. Cindera. Cinder of plants. Cinder of plants. Just a regular old bucket of snails. <laughs> Why are there snails? <laughs> I don't like that there are snails. Definitely bigger than a twin-sized bed. I would hope so. Toriel's a grown lady. She deserves her own bigger than a queen-sized bed. Inside the drawer are flower seeds and some broken crowns. Flower seeds? I'm suspicious. Room under renovations. Even more sus. Oh, it is a water sauce. <laughs> Touche, game devs. Touche. Look at this nice little mirror. Cute. Why is it at the end of the hall? That does not make your hall look longer like it should. What is that painting? Okay. This is a cute room. I actually have always wanted to have a red themed room. I would always make red themed rooms in Sims. We were meant to be here. Look at these cool toys! They don't interest you at all. <laughs> Look at them, they're so cool, but also not for me. Probably too young. Oh! <gasps> oh, I didn't want to do that! No! Is that pie? <gasps> Eat it. You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. <gasps> She's so good to us. I can't! She gave us the pie! An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. A box of kids' shoes in a disparity of sizes. Mm, I'm sus. I'm so sus. What if kids just fall down here all the time and she just keeps them here forever and then she makes them fat and eats them? Just feeds them a bunch of pie! Like the, like the witch in Hansel and Gretel. I'm going down into the basement. You can't stop me, Tamriel. We're going, we're running. No! I think you should play upstairs instead. What's down there? I'm so suspect and I can't get over it. Oh my God, she's reading so sweetly with her little glasses. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. But then she says sweet things like that, and then I feel really bad. There's so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. Oh. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Lies. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? Oh, my heart! <laughs> We've only known Toriel for so long, but she's so sweet and I don't want to say it, but I feel like I need to say it because I need to get back up to the top because I don't want to live here. I'm doing it. What? This, this is your home now. No, Toriel. Um, would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? Oh, it is called 72 Uses for Snail. <laughs> How about it? Oh no! How do we do this? I'm weak, I can't, I can't. Here's an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails have a chainsaw-like tongue called a radula? Interesting. something. Stay here. She's gonna eat me, you guys. Oh no. Look at the pie. Can I have it? The size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. Lies. I would eat that entire thing in a heartbeat. Give me the chocolate bar. Give me the chocolate bar. Oh, F. Oh, I don't like this. 
Mama don't like this at all. We told her we wanted to leave. I'm just gonna go down to the basement again. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. You wish Snow had returned home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. What? No one will ever be able to leave again. Wait, what? No! Now be a good child and go upstairs. No! No! How do I run faster? I can't go any faster! Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they... Asgore! They'll kill you. What is that? I'm only protecting you. Do you understand? She looks so unhappy. Go to your room. No! Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. No! You want to leave so badly? Hmm. You are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. I mean, I guess she's not that great of a teacher. If she kept telling people not to come down here and everyone has died, I'm just saying maybe that's not your calling. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Oh. To me, small one, if you go beyond this door, keep walking as far as you can. Eventually, you will reach an exit. Torio, no! Asgore, do not let Asgore take your soul! <gasps> That's scary. His plan cannot be allowed to succeed. The plan! If you told me about the plan before, I probably wouldn't have tried to go down the hallway, but here we are! 
Be good. Won't you? Oh no! My child! Maybe it's all a trick and she's okay and she's like, ba ha ha, you think I'd let you out of here? That's all I really want now. Why are we just walking through purple? <gasps> oh, are you kidding me? Oh, no, 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 she tried so hard to save you humans, but when it came down to it, <laughs> she couldn't even save herself. Oh my god, I'm terrible. What an idiot. Run away. Run away. I can't run away, but I need to run away. Oh no. I feel like we chose wrong. I feel like I chose very wrong by Toby Fox. Was that the end of it? Or is this the beginning? <laughs> I'm so confused. Okay. <laughs> Fine, everything's fine. I'm fine. We're just in the scary, scary woods now with trees that block our view. That's great. And twigs that we step on. And scary noises that make scary noises in the background that are echoey. It's totally fine. Everything's fine. I'm just not gonna listen to the scary. It's gonna be fine. We're gonna sing our way through. How long does this forest go? <laughs> why would I why would I walk over the sketchy bridge? Because there's nothing else I can do. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, no. Oh my goodness, no. I can't do anything. What's happening? What's happening? Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and no, <laughs> shake my hand. Mm, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Don't you dare shake that hand. Run away as far as you possibly can. What is that? Is that a skeleton? Is it gonna eat me? <laughs> the old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. <laughs> what? <laughs> It's always funny. Anyways, you're human, right? Yeah, maybe. What of it? That's hilarious. Is it? Um, Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you know. What? <laughs> I don't really care about capturing anybody. Oh, well, that's good. Now my brother, Papyrus, he's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. This gate thingy. Um, that's an accurate description, though. Thank you for saying that. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. <laughs> good. Well designed. <laughs> <laughs> Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. <laughs> I'm crying. Oh my god, it's so good. Oh, I'm crying. Oh, sup, bro? <laughs> you know what, sup, brother? <laughs> it's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp is really cool. 
Do you want to look? <laughs> a human then I can, the great papyrus will get all the things I utterly deserve respect recognition and we'll finally be able to join the royal guard well, look at that little cape flying around it's so cute people will ask to be my friend oh that is so sad oh. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning <laughs> <laughs> Maybe this lamp will help you. <laughs> Sam, you are not helping, you lazy bones. Get it, you lazy bones. You, all you do is sit and boondoggle. I don't know what that means, but I want to do it. You get lazier and lazier every day. <laughs> Take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work today. <laughs> a skeleton. <laughs> Smiling. <laughs> I am and I hate it. <laughs> Sigh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. <laughs> my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. See, that one didn't, didn't ring as well. <laughs> that one just didn't sound as sound the real it's the real joker. Hey! <laughs> okay, you can come out now. <laughs> Thanks, sons. <laughs> He's our friend. You want to get going, he might come back, and if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. <laughs> oh, I wouldn't mind that at all, sons. It's some sort of checkpoint or sentry station, but there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. <laughs> so I guess don't go that way, but that's the only way we should go. Actually, hey, hate to bother you. But could you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. <laughs> or he'd capture me, but, uh... Don't worry, he's not dangerous, even if he tries to be. I don't know if I believe that. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. Seriously? We have to go see the brother? Okay, well, let's see. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. <laughs> Snowden Box Road, file saved. Oh my goodness. That was honestly too much. That was literally too much for me to handle. I think before we hit any more bone jokes, we are gonna have to stop it there, you guys. <laughs> Uh, this has been a real laugh and a half. A real laugh attack, if you will. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that follow button or that like button or whatever the heck that it is on the YouTubes. I will be back very soon uh, with another video, episode three. Uh, in the meantime, if you missed episode one, it is, it is on the thing somewhere. It'll, it'll be available to you. And I will see you all next time. Thanks for hanging out. Bye, guys. <laughs>